Welcome to the vibrant world of German in Venice, a YouTube channel that takes you on a captivating journey through the daily life and experiences of Mike, an entrepreneur turned YouTuber. Join us as we delve into the authentic and humble content of German in Venice, where clickbait is nowhere to be found. Born out of his deep connection with Venice Oceanside, Mike brings an intimate understanding of the area's culture, atmosphere, and hidden gems. Having lived here for a significant part of his life, he offers viewers an insider's perspective making German in Venice a true reflection of the local spirit. What sets German in Venice apart is Mike's unwavering commitment to authenticity. With each video, he invites us into his world without any pretense or exaggerated claims. Through genuine moments, heartfelt conversations, and immersive storytelling, Mike establishes a deep connection with his audience. Step into the vibrant heart of Venice Beach as Mike takes us on captivating vlogs. From exploring the famous boardwalk to interacting with locals and delving into the area's eclectic subcultures, German and Venice showcases the real essence of this captivating coastal paradise. Since joining YouTube on February 6, 2019, Michael has uploaded a total of 642 videos to his channel. He has accumulated 324,000 subscribers and his videos have garnered 66 million views. On average, his channel receives 1.3 million views per month. In terms of revenue, Michael earns around $9,000 per month through the ads that run on his videos. Additionally, he also accepts donations from viewers through his PayPal account, which enables them to support him financially. As we wrap up this journey through German and Venice, it's clear that Michael has achieved remarkable success on YouTube. From his first video in 2019 to the present day, his dedication, authenticity, and captivating content have propelled him to become a beloved creator. Now it's your turn to share. We'd love to know what you love most about Michael and his channel German in Venice. Is it his down-to-earth nature, his immersive storytelling, or something else that keeps you coming back for more? Leave a comment below and join the conversation.